welcome back to my channel it is such a gloomy day it's still in rain season here so uh, i woke up feeling kind of like in a snuggly mood um so i think like today is going to be a perfect day for that because today's video is a collaboration with coca so as you guys are well aware of 2020 has been pretty crazy so far and it has had a very bad impact on a lot of small businesses and artists and fashion brands so in today's collaboration i am gonna go to ulkin's studio which is a korean fashion brand ulkin is actually really cool it stands for upcycling um, I really like that name and it is exactly what it sounds like. It's actually a fashion brand that focuses on recycling and upcycling, meaning making the product better and to give an old product new life. So that's exactly what I'm going to do today. I'm so excited. I'm going to head out to the uh, studio, but I'm so excited because I'll be painting on a bag today and I have a few ideas, but I'm going to show you my ideas when I get to the studio. Um, but it's just such a perfect thing to do now that it's so gloomy outside. I just want to sit inside and like chill and paint and hopefully they have coffee. <laughs> I'm in a good mood. Let's go guys! we came to the studio of Eukin now and uh, I think before we start painting the bag let's have a little uh, talk with the designer here welcome to my channel <laughs> 안녕하세요 안녕하세요 저희는 이제 얼킨이라는 브랜드고요 저희는 이제 실제로 이제 신진 화가들의 습작을 가지고 만드는 가방으로 시작을 했습니다 버려지는 작가들의 습작을 재활용해서 업사이클링 가방을 만들고요 그 가방을 판매하고 수익금의 일부로 그 전시도 열어드리고 새, 그새 캔버스로 교환도 해드리면서 작가분들이 이제 지속적으로 작업을 해가고 작가로서 성장해 갈수 있는 것에 좀 도움을 드리는 그런 브랜드예요. 네, 그리고 지금 이제 서울 패션위크랑 이번에 또 뉴욕 패션위크에도 나가게 됐어요. 그래서 패션 브랜드로서도 계속 성장을 해가고 있습니다. 와, here's an example. Yeah. 아, 여기 있는 이 그림들이 이제 버려지는 그림이었어요. 아 작가가 연습을 하고 이제 마음에 안 들면 그 그림을 이제 버리거나 혹은 이제 덮어서 새로 그리거나 이런 식으로 캔버스를 재활용을 하는데 그리고 나서 이제 정말 더못 쓰게 될때 이걸 버려요. 그러면 저희가 그거를 새 캔버스로 교환을 해드리는 거죠. 어차피 버릴 거면 저희한테 주세요라고 해서 저희가 받은 다음에 그다음에 또 새로운 작업을 하실 수 있게 새 걸로 바꿔드리거나 혹은 이제 아예 저희가 일부는 작품을 구매를 하는 경우도 있어요. 그런 식으로 작가분이 버리는 거를 저희한테 주고 더 다른 연습을 또할수 있게 환경을 만들어 드리는 거고 기존의 그림이라는 어떤 어, 물건에서 가방이라는 새로운 물건으로 탄생을 하는 그런 것이 업사이클링입니다. 와, 유니크한 제품. Oh, they got you. Okay, so now that we know a little bit about the brand, I'm really curious about how I'm gonna do while painting my own bag. So uh, thank you for letting us know about the brand and uh, let's get to painting. Okay, so guys, this is the one that I'm gonna be painting on. I think we're gonna paint here on the back. But I, we need a coating layer first, I think. First, I want to show you what I'm kind of planning on painting because I really want something like pastel-y, mm, dreamy maybe. So I found some pictures of a sky that's kind of like a sunset. I don't know. Is it sunset or sunrise? I don't. I think it's sunrise. Like this color, so pretty, right? I think this is gonna be cute with my style as well. On this one, maybe even with like a white dress like this. Yay! <coughs> Getting started is always the hardest part. <laughs> so I think if I want to do like this, I should paint the background first. And I see like a little bit of gradient bluish colors. Yeah, yeah. I love this. I used to paint so much. Um, yeah, but then I don't know what happened. When I came to Korea, I just stopped all my creative stuff. Maybe because 
I was editing so much, I was tired of being creative. <laughs> okay guys, let's put the first stroke down. Let's see, this is always like the worst when you have to start the painting. I think I finished with the um, background now. Let's see, because it's it's not going to be very visible when I'm done because I want to have a lot of clouds on it. Very dreamy, very beautiful. This is the hard part, like clouds, because the, the tricky part is to not think too much when you do clouds because it, oh, what is it, the, 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 the Ross guy, he always says, happy accidents. Isn't that what he says? Do you know who that is? What is his first name? So famous on YouTube. Painting. Bob. Uh -huh. Bob Ross, yes, oh. and he makes it look so easy and he's right. like, just do it like happy accidents. <laughs> <laughs> I should make a lot of happy accidents today, guys. In Korea we say Bob Ajoshi. Bob Ajoshi. Ah, Bob Ajoshi? Because uh, his name is Bob. Ah! Bob Ajoshi! Bob Ajoshi! <laughs> this, is, this has dried a little bit, not much, but I think it's fine because if the colors melt in a little bit, it's gonna be nice. Oh, this is so scary, I don't know. Okay. they put on the like finishing coat <laughs> I'm gonna show you the finished product I'm so happy with how it turned on so like this is the back it just says the logo and then the front Ta -da! oh my god I'm actually kind of surprised because at, at one point I kind of lost hope in myself <laughs> and then I wrote my name on it I don't know if that's narcissistic but I thought it looked cool <laughs> I think it turned out really nice well far away from it looks better We're so real right now. Let's keep it in. <laughs> the whole deal with this collaboration is that I should style the bags. Mm -hmm. And I thought, what better occasion to actually collaborate with Q1 and Qjin so that they could style me yeah, because mm -hmm. this is a street style brand. And if there's something that I'm not, it's street style. So what? I think you look good on street, street style. style. I do, but I don't really own a lot of street style stuff. <laughs> oh, really? Mm -hmm. I actually, you know, I think I have a few pieces and then once in a while I do it. I think um, you're the Soul Fashion Week. Oh, the, that one was a totally street, street style. style. Yeah. Right? Oh, yeah. But oh, you look really good. <laughs> oh, thank yeah. you. Well, I really love it. I would love to like experiment more with my style. And I think it's a really good occasion to actually try to do that because your style is so fun and like. Thank you. I mean, if <laughs> those of you, I think we have a lot of the same followers, but if those of you who don't know already, this is Kyutuhan and they have a really cool fashion channel, so you guys should definitely check it out. So guys, I think I want to show you guys some bags. Yes, yes. we're excited, excited to see. And then we can get to styling. Woo! Yay! Okay. <laughs> Surprise, Esther. Oh my god, let me show you beauties. Oh, this one first. And you guys already saw this. This is the one that I designed. Wait, I saw it on your IG, IG story. Yes! You're painting these. Yeah, so I was painting. Did you learn how to draw? Yeah, I used to draw so much back in like in school and yeah, it was just when I was younger and had more time. And then these are the bags Ooh. that the designers already prepared. Wow. This is very like contemporary art. Yeah. yeah. Like one stroke. Exactly. It's very like I chose the more like minimal kind of styled bags because mm. 
I don't know, they're easier to style. But then again, we have like also bags like this that are Whoa. probably a little bit like more harder. Harder. dressed up. Exactly. Right. Yeah. This chain is really pretty. Yeah. Oh, this one is really pretty. Look at this! Wow! Look at this that is really, really pretty! Cute. Okay, I was gonna go for like the conventional one, but then I was uh -huh. like, oh, maybe this will be the chain. Prettier. I love the chain's look. Like for the bag, I think the chain really changes <gasps> the vibe. That the looks bag. so good. Yeah, it does. It makes it a little bit more like edgy. Yeah, edgy. <gasps> yeah that is so, so cute! Great. For street style. For street style. Yeah. Like this. You can change up that the is chain. So cute. Guys, what I really want you to do is like choose. Let's first choose like one or two items and then try to style those okay. with an outfit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Kitohan brought so many different like clothes to my house. My house yes. looks like a teenage bomb exploded. <laughs> <laughs> well, I definitely want to do this one since you. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Should we do that one first? Then? Yes. I definitely want to do this one too. We start with this bag from Alkin uh -huh. And since we actually drew this, so beautiful yes. So for this though, we kind of want to go for like a uh, street style But very colorful and playful mm -hmm. Which is a style that I normally don't see Sizzle wearing it yes. So I still want to see it, so that's why we still like did this outfit <laughs> Yeah <laughs> So for here, she's wearing like a purple uh, oversized, oversized sweater sweatshirt. With this like um, cartoons here uh -huh. And then some beanie yes. I think cool. it's a perfect outfit for fall but mm -hmm. not summer, for sure, because yeah. it's too hot. hot. It was very hot. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she looked like bomb.com. Yes. <laughs> Next is this bag from Alkin, and for this look, we kind of want to go for like very elegant, classic, feminine, mm -hmm. beautiful look. <laughs> 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 so for here, she's wearing Cecil is wearing a Alice McCall beautiful white dress yeah. with like this. It's not white; it's like a, a creamy, creamy yellow with a heart shape here, mm -hmm. and then she's wearing a green song style sandal yeah. to kind of go with this green hue yeah. with the bag and then a white brim hat and a layer of gold necklace and she's just ready to go for a cruise yeah so, so elegant yes, love it you <laughs> The next look, we went with this air pocket. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we totally went for like so fashion week look, yeah. fashion insta look. Yeah, it's a very daring style, but I think Cecil pulled it off really well. Mm -hmm. And like the key point of this entire outfit is definitely the boots. Yes, the python boots. And I love how like she wore a white oversized shirt, and then there's like pop of this color, mm -hmm. which really added like a little accent to the outfit. So yeah, it was amazing. <laughs> so for the last look, we went for the one mile wear concept yes. And if you don't know, one mile wear means like a some, Something that you wear in one mile radius of, of your, your home. home Sorry, lost my switch <laughs> <laughs> It's really something that you just throw on, easy to wear mm -hmm. Casual. Casual. That's the look that we went for yeah. with this bag. I think here you can put like your notebook, iPad, and just like go to cafe, cafe right? and chill and just do your work. Yeah. She's is wearing a slip dress, mm -hmm. and on top of that, she's wearing a linen blazer. It's a blazer, but it's a linen material, so it's very breathable for summer. Yes. And then for the shoe, she's just wearing a flip flop, flip flop, and then some bucket hat yes. and some and gold accessories. Yeah. So that was uh, the whole styling video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And like, Q1 and Qjin did such a good job with the fashion items. I have <laughs> never worn something like that before. And I think it's really nice to try something new so yes. you can like broaden your taste maybe. Yeah. Um, and thank you so much to Alkin for partnering up with me for this video. I absolutely love the idea of upcycling and reusing fashion and making it way better mm -hmm. and also incorporating art in it and being creative in the process. I love that. So once again, check them out down below in the description box and also Q2Han. They do amazing content and see you next time. Bye bye! bye, -bye.